Good morning, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. Gosh, I slept in, and it was the best decision I ever made. I woke up at like 6.30 first, and my phone was so hot. It went under my pillow, and it was also charging, and it was like burning hot. And I woke up at 8, but now it's 9. And I feel so good. I feel so well rested. And I really needed that. Um, breakfast finishes at 10. So I'm just gonna get changed and go to breakfast very quickly and then come back and get on with the day. I need to edit yesterday's vlog to post today. Excited. Okay, just popped on my breakfast outfit. I'm wearing my Lululemon Align shorts. They're so comfortable. I don't know why it took me so long to ever buy from Lululemon. Probably because it's expensive. Yeah, that's why. Um, and then my Nike Air Maxes. And then my blue jumper. Off to breakfast. <laughs> very much not used to eating that quickly after I've woken up. I was just scared that I was going to miss breakfast, which I would have. <laughs> but we're here now and we are going to edit yesterday's vlog. Edit and upload. This is exciting. I feel like it's giving me something like productive to do every single day. I mean, Things can be unproductive, and productive, whatever. Anyway, we're gonna get to it. And then I'm gonna get on with the rest of my day. I have just finished editing yesterday's vlog and I'm about to upload it. I actually love the Christmas music that I found for it. Um, so, yeah. Um, I think I'm actually just going to make some tea, relax, watch, catch up on my favorite youtubers of vlogmas is um i'm gonna go out tonight so i actually had to cut a lot of talking out of my other it was a whole hour um which i've cut down to 30 minutes so yeah i if that shows you how much i had to cut out then um i need to get christmas presents um for some people here so i don't think i'll get them today i think i'll because i'm going out tonight with a friend for dinner so i think i'll get them maybe tomorrow which is tomorrow saturday it will give me something to do on saturday so and i think i'll be able to give it to them maybe on monday or tuesday so yeah look at the view it's so nice i also think i might go to the gym i think it'll keep me active for today so I actually really miss my Pilates. I got a really good deal um, for my Pilates, which is so good. It's right next to F45. And so basically they were doing this thing. Um, usually, because I was going to go, after I've done the 28 day challenge, which I've just finished, I was going to do three days a week, which cost like $60. 60 or 70 dollars but then um they were doing a black friday deal and it was unlimited classes for the week for 60 dollars unlimited so as much as you want but then i found out that it was unlimited access to fs8 which is the pilates that i go to and f45 which is next door so i'm so excited if that i still can't believe that I got that deal because that is if you know how much Pilates classes are and how much F45 is per week that could have easily been definitely over $100 a week but now it's like $60 which is just it blows my mind so I'm very excited to start doing F45 as well I think it'll help me with my cardio and just getting my arms strong because my arms are so weak but yeah, I'm very excited to go back home and get into that. Um, so, 
yeah just waiting for the video to download and then i'll upload it but i was gonna say i'm very excited about the christmas music that i found and i picked i don't know if i should do like an intro i don't think i have anything intro ish maybe oh yeah i don't know we'll see let me know if you liked yesterday's vlog or what else you'd like to see so i might start looking like go around looking for christmas-esque things to do i actually might buy an ornament whilst i'm here because i think i liked the idea of um matching ornaments like an aesthetic christmas tree but then i also i'm very sentimental so i feel like i like the idea of picking ornaments and it being like meaningful so i wish i had bought some ornaments when i was in adelaide i went to this really like it's a german town basically it's like german back in the back in the day it's very cottagey and there was a um art store like a what's that artisan i don't know but it, everything was handmade and it was such beautiful ornaments like little ballerinas there were unicorns they were like deers and reindeers and it was just so beautiful and i wish i would picked something because i feel like that would have also been a memory like oh just before christmas i went to adelaide on a really lovely trip um when i was 24 oh, i keep saying i'm 22 i'm 24 oh gosh when i was 24 so yeah i think i'm gonna start doing that now and just do sentimental ornaments as well i might make some too that could be fun <laughs> TikTok, actually a few TikToks whilst I was getting ready and I absolutely love this blush combination. It's very bright right now so you can't see how good it looked in like diffuse lighting. Oh there it is. I love it so much. It looks so good. I what I filmed was like an I'm called makeup look and I feel like I feel like I nailed the brief. I feel like it looks very heavy on this camera, but in the mirror, it's very light. Strange. I guess this camera just picks up the pinks and the reds and all that stuff. I'm wearing my Frankie's bikini play suit romper and this cardigan that I got from the op shop. It's so, so cute. I think it's like I googled the, the, like the label and it's like... Korean designer I think anyway that's what this is I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear for pants because I can't just go out like this because the shorts they're more right up so I think I'm just gonna wear 
I think I'm just gonna wear jeans. I don't know. A part of me wants to wear my skirt, but also, I think I just wanna be comfortable. I think I'm just gonna wear my jeans. The look isn't bad, but it's also not my most favorite. I think I just don't like myself in pants, and that's totally okay. But we're gonna roll with it because I, know, I just want to be absolutely, completely comfortable, and then I'll just probably button this up when I get too cold because I feel like I'm gonna be out for a little while. Um, I'm going to. Should I wear my sneakers or should I wear? these little heels walking in these is i'm really fine with walking in them it's either that or i wear my little cowboy boots again i think these little heels kind of pull the look up a little bit like elevate it so it's not too homey you know okay i actually ended up wearing my ballet <laughs> shoes because i don't know just didn't want to wear heels and I like how it looks. Very cute, very simple. Um, I'm meeting my friend at a train station called Circular Key. I don't know where that is. So I'm leaving half an hour early so that one, I don't have to walk super fast. And two, so that I'm not late and can figure out where it is. Walking. Ah, oh, it's like a 30 minute walk. Yeah, so I'll leave now. Oh, I'm gonna have such a good walk. Fantastic. Well, let's go for a walk. feel comfortable walking through Hyde Park this late at night it's like 11 um, but it's Friday night and everyone's out so if it was 11 during the week no I'd walk all the way around but because it's there's just so many people here there's a lot of people here so I don't feel uncomfortable walking late around here it's actually quite a nice walk um, Yeah, dinner was nice. A bit scary. When you're on, um, I've been to that area a few times, but the opera house area, the seagulls there are so bold. Like I, I, I saw them snatch food. Um, so I was a little bit on edge the whole time. And then we went to find somewhere that had hot drinks because it was really cold over there. Um, and that girl did a concert. She's actually such a good singer. And it was just really nice. So now I'm going back and I'm trying to think of what I'll do tomorrow because when I was walking to um, dinner, I walked past the botanical gardens and it looked really nice. And I have some work to do for a specific brand and I feel like the content that I would make in that area, even around here, would be really nice. I just regret not bringing my tripod. And I would have, I would have used my tripod there because it would have been a lot easier. 
Um, so, and it also had like the Bluetooth remote. So I don't know what I'm gonna end up doing. Um, it just would've been really, really nice. But maybe I'll find a way to do it without my tripod, which then makes it kind of look more natural. You know what I mean? Like that kind of like casual fit check vibes. So either that or I'll just do it in my hotel room. Either way, I'm gonna do some work tomorrow um, because I did say that I would hand in the content today or tomorrow and I inadvertently chose tomorrow. Um, and then what, that's Saturday. And then on Sunday, Sunday is when I'll get all the Christmas presents sorted because I'll probably go into the office on Monday. I know I'm definitely going into the office on Wednesday. So, but I think that will be like a brief visit. So, yeah, that's the plan. Now we're just gonna go home, probably edit this vlog, and then go to sleep. I'm actually pretty tired. I think I've done a good job of like wearing myself out every night. Like I was getting pretty sleepy during dinner, so.